One of the many paintings in the collection of Dudley Museum Service is this splendid view of Dudley Castle by Thomas Phillips. Its title is The Parade of the Loyal Association in Dudley Castle Courtyard, 9th of August, 1798. It depicts a gathering of companies of volunteers at a celebration for the birthday of the first Earl of Dudley, John William Ward. On show is the Dudley Loyal Cavalry, led by the appropriately named Captain Thomas Dudley, the Dudley Loyal Infantry, led by Thomas Wainwright, and a colourfully dressed military band. The artist, Thomas Phillips, was born in Dudley in 1770. He was apprenticed to Francis Edgington, a Birmingham glass painter, and in 1790 he went to London with an introduction to Benjamin West, who employed him to paint glass windows for St George's Chapel in Windsor. Phillips entered the Royal Academy Schools in 1791, where he would have learned to paint the standard subjects of religion, romantic views and classical mythology. One of his first exhibits at the RA was a view of Windsor Castle. Phillips developed an interest in painting portraits and quickly became very successful in that field, painting famous scientists and thinkers of the day, as well as society men and women. This early painting is a wonderful view of the castle ruins in his hometown, with the Union Jack flying proudly above the massed crowds admiring the parade. Amongst the display of military might, the eye is drawn to the domestic details in the foreground, the small family group and the cavorting dogs. The whole scene is a classical view of the natural world, the romantic ruins and the human element of the townspeople enjoying a celebration of local and national import. Phillips, at a young age, shows an assured command of composition, colour and content. He went on to achieve positions of great importance at the Royal Academy and continued his prolific career as a portrait painter. From his beginnings in Dudley, he died a rich and respected artist in Mayfair. To learn more about the many paintings in Dudley's collection, please visit the Museum at the Archives when it reopens and join one of the Art Appreciation Workshops.